the perfect thing to eat when you've had like a cold day by the water mm, and true. then you come inside and it's like dark and you've been out with like your, your your yellow rain slicker on yeah and then you come in and have some warm <clears throat> fisherman's pie hello and welcome back to Norpin south and September pies, where every day of September we're making a pie, yo. Um, today I'm making a pie that I never would have considered making before. It's just not something that was ever on my radar. And I guess if you're here, you saw the title. I'm making fish pie or fisherman's pie. We do eat some fish around here, but we don't eat it very often. I like fish. Well, how I love the puzzle. Um, But fish and pie in my mind just never went together. But. I figured September pies is the time to try to make a fish pie. It's such a traditional pie in the UK. And as I read the recipe for it, I was like, actually, this might be pretty good. It's essentially a, like a shepherd's pie with a layer of mashed potatoes on the top. And, but it's a creamy white gravy with the fish and peas and spices. I think it might actually be pretty good, but we'll find out. So let's do it. <laughs>
So the pies are done. They're dinner, complete dinner in a pie. Yes. You could obviously eat some salad, but we're not going to. <laughs> salad. <laughs> no. Um, the kids did inform me this is what she eats in Kiki's well, delivery she service. She delivers it at one point. And it looks, and it really, looks really delicious. Really good. She okay. gets this from his grandma. It has a little fish design on the side, and whenever I watched it, it was really cute. Hi, Haku. Hi. Whenever I watched it when I was little, it always made me really hungry because I didn't realize there was fish in it. Um, now I'm excited to see whether it will actually be good because I'm, I'm a suspicious of fish. Suspicious of fish. Suspicious of fish. I'm not cutting it with pie suspicious. stuff because it's... No, that doesn't make any sense. Ooh. It looks pretty good. It looks hot, I'll say that. Hey, not as hot as me though. Oh. I tried to do like a little like wave design on there, but it's randomly. Didn't really work, I don't think. Which is a very busy you know, I'll just let you guys get your own. Piece of cloth. Yeah, everyone, scoop your own. <laughs> Wait, sorry, what you want. Want. Is it super hot? Yeah. But does it taste good? Fish pie sounds weird. What do you think? Does it taste weird? Nope. No? It tastes good? It tastes really good and also tastes like fish. It doesn't taste bad. Like, tastes like fish in a good way? Yeah. Okay. How about those potatoes? Are those good? Potatoes have got to be good, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. They're good. Eve, what do you, what's your take on this whole thing? Yes, bead. Yes, bead. Mm. Duh. You like it? Uh. Yeah. It's really good. Um, It's like very like lemony and um, the fish is really good and it goes really well together with the mashed potatoes. Is there anyone at this table who doesn't like it? I haven't today taken a bite. I was waiting. We're going to get Andrew's real reaction here. Uh. Real time? I was suspicious of the fishy fish pie, but it is surprisingly, superly fishtastic. Ooh! Fantastic! No, it's really good actually. And it doesn't taste like fish, which is always a compliment for fish for some reason. But it, it, <laughs> you mean it doesn't taste fishy. No, it doesn't taste fishy. It tastes like creamy, like Esther said, really creamy, really lemon limey, but like also that mashed potato, really good. And then the, the fish it hits. It's a good meat in there, you know. I like it a lot. It tastes good, but our, she made this pasta a couple weeks ago. It was just like salmon and butter and pasta. And it was, it, it was really good and it's, it's like a very similar taste. Reminds you of that? Taste. Okay. Feeling. It seems like the perfect thing to eat when you've had like a cold day by the water. Mm, and then true. you come inside and it's like dark. And you've been out with like your, your, your yellow rain slicker on. Yeah, and then you come in and have some warm <clears> fisherman's <throat> pie. Sometimes they call it fish pie, other times they call it fisherman, and I think fisherman's perfect. It seems like really, truly the best thing you'd want to eat. So yum. That's good. Now it's my turn. I set up the camera, no one's holding it. It's just me and the camera. We're all alone. Or let's pretend like we are. I'm gonna it's eat this. Romantic. It's just me and you <laughs> having a little meal together. Don't mind all the other sounds. It's like we're in a restaurant. There's other people there, but they're not with us. What are you doing? I'm gonna, I'm gonna taste it. But I got the camera. It's just me and the camera here. I hate hot food though. I don't want to burn my mouth. It's not too hot. Hmm. It is very good. I really like the lemon. I added the lemon. Really? Was it on the recipe? It should have been. Megan says the lemon wasn't part of the recipe, but I really like how it sort of brightens it all up. The fish is all very good, and the potatoes are really good. Mmm. Really good. Fish pie did not sound like a good thing to me, but it's yummy. Mm -hmm. Or at least this recipe is. So, this is a win. Mmm. All right. That's it. It was good. It was good. And, like, really made me wish that I had been on a cold ocean, like, on the on a co cold coast before eating it, because it would have been perfect. So, next time we'll do that. Remember when we were in Oregon and, like, we went to the fish and chips place, like mm -hmm. nothing tasted better. Like when That's you've been true. on the ocean and the salty air and you're kind of cold. Yum, yum. Pretty good, something about it. So when I first heard that there was such a thing as fish pie, I thought that sounded so disgusting to be honest. I'm like, what, fish pie? But it was really good. So you should definitely try it out. And it wasn't actually too hard. So if you've got an afternoon free and it's a chilly day, fish pie might be the way to go. Either way, thanks for coming along and don't forget to come back tomorrow for another pie. See ya. See ya.